What happens when you have a team of passionate gamers with years of experience with anime and gaming put into Honkai Star Rail? You get a spicy nostalgic event called Ethereum Wars. And if you haven't guessed by now, it's basically Pokemon. The developers put their memories of childhood directly into this event with many references to Pokemon, including Jesse and James. I only played one part of this event, but afterwards, I realized that this can be in fact easy to be made into a PvP game. Now why is that? Simply because this involves no wallet versus wallet concept. Everyone pretty much had the same eat the spirits. Only difference is what chip they place on their spirits. I really think the concept and development of this mode can be taken further beyond. My first thought of how this mode can be expanded is within each new update and the main story. We add newer mods to the game to keep it fresh and renewed. Because this event doesn't disappear and is a permanent thing, this can be the first major PvP party game. If they are able to draw in other mods from different Hoyoverse games, it definitely would be cool. A Holy Troll can be in this game for a Genshin reference or something from Honkai Impact. The list goes on. If we encourage it, they might add it. I personally feel it'd be cool if they added like a Exodia from Yu-Gi-Oh like thing. For example, if they did a card style element to this, you can summon Pantelia or another weekly boss to fight on your side. To make it fair, once she's summoned, no other spirits on your side can be used and the other team has to fight her with their four unless they summon a weekly boss themselves. They can even add the swarm bars after they fuel their gauge up. Maybe like if your crew of spirits have all their specials up, they can summon their weekly boss after a set amount of turns. Now of course, the PvP can be the usual ban of eat the spirits to make things fear for players' strategy. With the ever-growing roster of spirits, if they shall add it, we can really see a PvP mode be made by the developers themselves. For chips, bans to be applied as so, or the game can really generate it showing what side got what. The players can choose one chip dedicated to their use, something like that. Just a little rough draft idea as had in my mind. Not fully fleshed out yet, but hey, if I make a follow-up video on this talking about it, sure. So yeah, took me a few days to just sit down to produce this video due to my sheer laziness. Still more to come. I really hope they do incorporate something like that into a PvP mode, which is wallet versus wallet friendly. Hell, make a Mario Party at this point. Aside from that, I just really enjoyed this game mode. Like, comment, subscribe, and all that jazz. Share your opinions about this mode. How will you feel this game mode? was turned into a PvP mode, do you think it will be fun for people? What other ideas do you guys have that can potentially go into this? I mean, hey, it's worth a shot. Maybe we can say something to developers. Hey, yo, make a PvP mode. It's very friendly, and I, I assume. It, it probably it will get sweaty, sure, at some point. But, you know, just something to do, pass the time. 